as per floor plan we have created our model then we have applied it load we have uh, analyzed our uh, model then check as per our code now it's time to design our structure this is the most important part of our structure so from that part we'll start designing our structure so before design we have to select for which load combination will go for design and you have to understand the design criteria or how software will work actually so uh, first of all i'll you may go here design then concrete frame design you will get that option here otherwise you may able to click here and also same option you will get here now first of all view or revised preferences actually this is very important here you have to select the design code for which code you are going to design or which code software will use to design your structure so if you click here you will get all code available here okay all code you will get available here so i'll close that then here so i'm going to use or i'm going to design as per p on it 19 number of interaction card you have to select as per your requirement then design for dc beam column capacity ratio obviously will go for it then ignore benefits a beneficial pu uh, for beam design uh, yes seismic design category from here you have to select the seismic design category as per your code so uh, i'm going to design for d uh, i'm going to select for d as per my requirement but for your case you are able to select that option then design system of uh opener, I, I mean uh, omega from here you are able to change it as per your requirement the row value of row change it as per your requirement then uh sds 0.5 phi for uh beam design 0.9 so uh we know uh, for uh getting tension control i mean for uh the value of a strain 0.005 we have to use 0.95 strain reduction factor to get tension control and must remember that always we have to design all of our structure as a tension control structure i mean if we provide the value of phi if on a 0 0.9 then we'll get the a strength of our i mean uh, a strength ratio of our structure it's 0 0.005 so for that 0 0.005 that means our structure will be under rainfall design so software will design that structure as a under rainfall design from our academic knowledge we know about that and then for column we know for compression control if tight then our strength reduction factor will be 0 0.65 and uh, phi for a spiral column or a spiral compression control member it will be 0 0.75 then the value of phi for share or torsion it's also 0 0.75 and you are able to modify all of that value as per your requirement okay then phi for share seismic it's uh, 0 0.6 as per actually the value here given value here given a default value so if you need to change anything you are able to change it so see uh top to bottom top to bottom you will be uh, able to change all of that value as per requirement right so i'm not going to change anything here at this time and if you change anything you will see a red color nothing to worry about it i'll click okay then i'll go here and uh, must we have to select the sorry uh we'll click here we'll click here to select our design combination 
before starting a uh, design we have to select design combination or what design will go for uh, our final output and here i'll select the combo we have created all combo as per our code we have created i'll select that and i'll click here and uh, actually the combination for uh, plus 30 percent diagonal earthquake we didn't select for that so uh, for your case you may able to select that or you may able to create that load combination if i got time i will create another uh, video on it that then uh, that how can we create combination for it now how our software work or how our software will pick up a combination from here to design a structure suppose we have uh, designed a member and uh, every combination will give different different value okay and our software will give the maximum output from that combination clear so uh, from that combination we'll get the maximum output actually like uh, suppose for that 5a combination 5a1 combination we get 1.5 inches square reinforcement and for combination 3a4 we get 1.1 on inches square combination then from them the above value will be shown here and for that above value we have to design and must remember must remember at a certain time at a certain time different combination will not be effective for our structure only one combination will be effective for our structure so i'll click okay when every combination is here i'll go for that okay then we are all set to go for analysis and i mean go for design so i'll go here i'll click here to run analysis and before uh, to run analysis very fast i will uh, stop that option because now uh, from center of rigidity that option is not required for us okay and must remember uh, check that all of our combination are okay here and i'll click okay I'll click run analysis and after completing our analysis we'll click here and click here for a start design or check okay directly click here to start design or check otherwise come here design and concrete frame yes start design or check or press shift plus f6 okay so click anywhere you need i will click here and we have to wait we have to wait till our design so we done it and in our next lecture we'll go for a step by step design procedure for beam for column and also how we'll uh, find out the detailing of it then share all a staircase slab okay so thank you Thank you very much.